coming this summer. Based on the critically acclaimed children's book, If You Give a Fish a Family, which is based on a true story. Except obviously some things were changed to make it more dramatically appropriate. Which is told on a podcast, which you're listening to right now, except technically it wasn't a book. It was an audiobook since you listened to it instead of reading. One fish far from home. You are now banished. No! One family. This is my family. We're not your family! But what if you were? One fish! Wait, I already said one fish. One wish! Both multiple wishes. These wishes will change everything. Or will they? What do you wish for, fish? No. Because he already had his wish, and his wish was a family! Starring Gillian Tidestrider as Gillian Tidestrider. Gillian Tidestrider as Chip. Gillian Tidestrider as Jay. And Vin Diesel is Dominic Toretto! Destiny won't save you this time, Gillian. I know. But this is my family! The Fist and the Furious, coming soon to theaters near you. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Just Roll With It. My name is Grizzly. I'm the DM. This is Riptide. Welcome back. These are the dudes, the goons, the squad, the baby girls, my players. Take it away. Hey, we're all my busy. I'm playing <laughs> shit okay. on, it, on the show. <laughs> we're going to get we're started okay. with Riptide Pirates. What is that, man? Yeah, listen. What we said is before that? this that we would do it normal. I've been watching Peaky Blinders recently. That's such a good oh, show, dude. You know, good show. I know, it's right? A good show. I know, right? But why do they talk like that? It's What's not up? even geographical. So you sound they like do, a man. you sound like a deep sea fish. You don't even sound like a person. <laughs> it's, it's more like yeah. it's more hey, like guys. my impression of British on pain meds. You sound like what an angler fish would sound like. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Condi, number one baby girl on Just Roll With It. You're a legend, dude. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I play Jay Farron, and uh, yeah, this is this is Riptide. We're the Riptide Pirates. Charlie, bring it in. Okay, I'm gonna flip a coin. <laughs> <laughs> I don't brace myself. Oi, it's Tails, bro. What's going on? Welcome back to the Riptide Pirates. Oi, I'm Charlie Sajigal. Fucking back in the game, it? Getting the what's the what's the what's the crack shitting myself ready in my chair ready to fuck. Um, let's just get right into it. Eh? Where we last left off, the three of you, captains of the Riptide Pirates, return to the town of Zero on the island of Canella, where you followed up this beautiful rainbow painted steps in a new and vibrant town minus that one little section that's really dingy and old and broken down um and found yourselves following ollie up the steps into the middle of the town where you saw that fountain you met mr rico the almost town almost tried to kill you uh but they realized it was you guys who uh once you know started the uprising against the uh, tyrannical and sort of oppressive uh, raft the navy and then they said they were going to throw a festival for you but in that moment, Ollie learned that his mother was in the Canvas District, the rundown place I mentioned beforehand, where you guys followed and found her literally worried sick. Um, but in this infirmary in the Canvas District, Ollie and his mother reunited, shared a very wholesome moment, only to be interrupted by some peculiar, not so happy and joyful a very shady figure coming in and, and chip overhearing that he was demanding money from this very poor very hopeless uh, part of the town and then after all of you uh went to the very very top returning to the navy tower that you blew up some months ago only to find marshall john's journal <laughs> labeled <laughs> as a logbook and then after reading some of these entries and tossing it to never be found again somewhere lost in the wind. Gillian knocked out to attempt a long rest midday here, just before sunset. And so the journey continues. Uh, we should pick right back, back, back up uh, where we left off. Gillian literally slumps 
and uh, Jay, Chip, you guys are still standing at the steps. Dre just recently swung by, saw you, um, and then headed off into the Umbrella District. So, Chip, what's the plan here? Are we going to break You him look around? over, I'm drawing on Gillian's face. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, nothing. I just, and I start, like, rubbing it off. Nothing. I just. Come, come on, what? man. I thought you'd be, like, a little more tasteful about it, at least. I. I don't know. I'm just trying to draw like a, like a smiley face. That was balls. No, it was a smiley face. They were, they were. Just stare at Chip, piercing gaze. Make a perception check. Okay, it was balls, but I never. <laughs> <laughs> perception check. I can do it. Eighteen. Yeah, with an eighteen, you can tell it's balls. <laughs> so you are looking at Chip. And obviously you can feel however you want, but just past him, because you're so observant, you do catch the glimpse of what you would know to be some sort of, or this island's take on like a sundial, um, just Ooh. behind him, up on like sort of, uh, just kind of like past the crumbled walls of this, uh, the very top of this town here, uh, leading into like these very beautiful homes. In like the center, it, you just see like the, the sundial casting a shadow. And what you would assume based on like the map, the road signs and stuff that's like the renaissance district of the town uh, and you would oh. get that it is like just past noon well we've got the whole day ahead of us uh he needs his like kind of pet go on God, on the head noon Fuck eight dude. hours um oh shit black so what's the plan there's a cool sundial over there i just found out the time fire you know we could go check that out do you like telling time yeah i don't mind telling time <laughs> but Gillian's what is not the same thing to say? <laughs> awake. Uh huh. Jay and I walk away, and as I'm like walking around pacing, I just drop at least the part of Gillian I was holding up, if any, if any. <laughs> <laughs> I drop him. I start walking, pacing back and forth. I'm walking away, and then I look back at her. What's something stupid we can do? Something stupid? A plan, Jay. But not uh -huh. just any plan. And I go up and I get right up next to her. A scam. <laughs> I mean, think about it. These people herald us as heroes. I, I I haven't earned anything from that. Have you? I don't think you have. I don't know. I mean, I've I've gotten the the joy of helping people. Um, but yeah, my wallet's really empty right now, actually. So may, maybe a scam isn't. You know. Yeah, the joy of helping people is so great, but it can't buy us a, a new, new ship. A new ship. Is that where you're going to say? I feel like you're going to say. I was going to say specifically like that thing at the end of the ship, but I couldn't think of the word. Oh, you're talking about the, the helm? That No, no, the not the helm. The rudder. Not the rudder either. God. No, I'm thinking of, it's like a, it's like some people have it like it's a mermaid and then the boobies, but no, but it's like different. <laughs> that's at the front that's of a, the ship. A that's figurehead, a figurehead, a figurehead, yeah, right? That's at the front of the ship. The thing you used to ram people. Wait, what do you want to replace our current figure head with i don't know i figured we could come up with that as a crew right something that strikes fear in the heart of our enemies when we're sailing at them very fast and something that's like right at the front and is gonna ram into their ship and completely destroy everything they've built yeah you know actually i feel like uh we need something more representative of you on the ship so i'm thinking maybe we uh what if it was my face break. really big no 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 <laughs> barrel barrel i think a barrel a barrel why does, why does like, that represent the statue are you, are you saying I'm the barrel? Yeah, I mean, I'm obviously the bird. Killian's obviously the fish. So you've got to be the barrel, right? Was there not a... Was there not <laughs> Was there not a me in the statue? <laughs> I mean, there's a fish, a barrel, and a bird. And no, you're no, not no, a there bird. had to be me. There had to be me. Come on, Killian. Get him. Oh, my fucking He's so heavy. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> Let me bring him. Do we have? We, do we have like a? We had like a pretzel one. We we, we had, had a like pretzel a pretzel one. Yeah. 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 I can't remember if that which ship that was or which. We did. This that, was that it, it did get damaged. Hey, so speaking about uh, plans, you know, there's a festival going on. You know what? A great way to scam people is carnival is games. Oh, <gasps> you are so smart. You're like the smartest person I know. You don't need to tell me that twice. I know. Okay, just take the compliment. No, keep, okay. it's fine. I'm smart. I get it. 
It's okay. I did. I just said it once. I mean, I just like reiterated it, but it's more like a, like I said it in a different way. Please, you flatter me. You're being sarcastic. You're messing with me. Yeah. Dick. <laughs> We're walking over towards the statue. This is this that is central town. So if like you're looking at that picture I sent last session, it's the middle of the town. It's all the way down the steps. It's gonna be a bit. Uh, to get to yeah. that, that we'll mountain pretty much again. Just walk there carrying Gillian. Okay, yeah. It takes yeah. like, man, um, we'll just say about 20 minutes. 10, 10 minutes, 15. Yeah, it's, a, it's a walk. It's a walk. It's down the steps. <laughs> yeah. It's a walk, yeah. It's a straight shot. We'll, it's really we'll say this conversation was like Basically leading like the town up to square. this place. Yeah. <laughs> and we get there. Huh. See, look. Yeah. Fish. Fish. Barrel. Bird. Barrel. Bird. Uh, why am I a barrel? <laughs> you see, uh, like like umbrellas <laughs> floating uh, up on one side of the umbrella district, and then bubbles gently, just like floating past the sir, the water that gently streams down the fountain. Is there anybody like walking nearby? Tons of people walking past. I want to grab somebody by the collar of their shirt. Excuse me. Ah! Pull you over. Oh, thank you so much for your time. I was just wondering if you could tell me what's up with that uh, that statue. You know, what does each thing represent specifically, or who who it represents, if anybody. Um, you know, if you might know. I'd like to think this person is one of those people who would have a cigarette in their ear and I want to pull it out. I don't know why I thought that. I just did. <laughs> why do they have a cigarette? What are you talking? Oh, like on their on yeah, the side of it. Yeah, they have it in the ear because I've got them up right next to like me and I want to grab it off. a person. I thought you meant that they just had cigarettes sticking <laughs> out of their ears. <laughs> grab it and snip I, it. So I, it's bad for you. I throw it. <laughs> I rolled to see if they'd be hostile towards you for doing that. As soon as you grab their their collar and you pull them out, you pull them next to you, they actually just immediately put their arm around you, sort of like, oh yeah, bro. So check this in. <laughs> Long time ago, you know, we had these mm-hmm. uh, these crazy fucking pirates, all right? Uh, he pulls a cigarette out of his, like you take one from his ear, so he pulls one out of his like vest pocket. He's got like <laughs> white, like it's just like a white shirt on. He's kind of buzz cut right now. Uh, he's got this like long pointy nose, like a crook uh, at the middle. And he's like, he's like lights up. So he's crazy pirates or whatever. There's like more just come in. They blow up the tower up, so up, 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 up over the top, right? That's why it's in crumbles yeah. now. And awesome. we get a glimpse of them. And one of them uh, with scales, like a big, uh, big fish man, they kept saying. Okay. Legendary. I've never seen a fish in my entire life. Uh, he looks down at where you're going. Oh shit! They're like that, right there. Yeah, yeah. yeah and, but, um, okay, and, and next. And uh, just like that, the person right there kind of looks just like that. And um, they were there, gave this like you know speech where the people in the square were already cowardice and 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 just uh, you know letting the the government just walk right all over the town because you know we didn't really have anything to any reason to stand up. We didn't want people to get hurt. But uh, this uh, this speech was so arousing to everyone in the in the, in the square at the moment. We you took up arms. Arousing, and we, right? Not. <laughs> Just let let him talk, okay? <laughs> okay. No, it was arousing? No, no miss, I mean arousing. <laughs> Quite literally, I mean arousing. It was a really good speech, right? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so, uh, yeah, just I mean, carried we, away. Um, I get it. it happens um, to me too. We just assumed that they died in the battle along with us, and um, <laughs> that's, so that, that's where it all started. Yeah. So the fish is the fish, and what are the others? The bird is. Oh right. So there's a kid holding a barrel. And a bird holding a barrel. So we thought... Ah, okay. Kid. More of a, you know, a man, right? You know, right? like a man. No, I distinctly remember like a like an infant. I heard the stories. <laughs> like a baby. Oh, no, it was There's a, a baby a... riding a barrel. A woman with wings holding a barrel. I, feel, I don't know, I didn't, I didn't make the statue, bro. I didn't even have one back then. That's crazy. I think they got... And a giant a fish. A giant fish. Just like this man right here. I go up to the statue with him, like we're we're like locked in, and I want to look around for a baby. <laughs> <laughs> you like step up onto it. He's he's like helping you up, 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 and you look inside the barrel, and you see like a little infant, like what a stick of stone. I like it's like like one of those like cartoons where there's like a whoosh sound every time I move my head. It's I like look in and I look like a little up baby. at Jay. Like, Baby's holding a sword. <laughs> Mouth That's agape, hard, I look dude. back in, I look back at Jay, I look back in, I look at, at Jay. That's crazy, you bro. Wonder where that baby's going now. Bright future ahead of him, he didn't die yeah, in the battle. man, I wonder where that baby's gone. <laughs> Get down. Damn, it wasn't a baby, it was a man. <laughs> I mean, you were That's like messed up. a little bit of a baby back then, yeah, to be fair. I mean, how do you know, huh? Oh, yeah, that was us. Um, I, but like, <laughs> I, I wasn't a baby. I don't look like a baby to you, do I? 
I'm like manly, you know? Like, you know, I walk into a room and I, I command respect, right? You would respect me if I just... You know, Wait, I, sorry, I have bro. that... Sorry, bro, you say it was you. Yeah. You're the barrel man. You're the ba you're the barrel baby. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm the barrel man. I gotta say, bro, you don't look look much like a like a like an infant. I grew up. What do you want me? To I'm not. A, it wasn't a baby. You've got two swords too, mate. Like I, baby only has one. Oh, bro, I gotta, not go, the barrel go, baby. I gotta, I gotta go to my restaurant, bro. So uh, you mind letting me go and have a good day, yeah? Chip cherry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe we'll come by. Right, What's so your restaurant me, called? Oh right. Um. Just down here in the uh, bubble district, it's called uh, Espresso. It's a coffee shop. No, oh. sounds lovely. All right, maybe we'll come by. Right on. I was like back to Jack. <laughs> we are not coming by. Yeah, that guy literally just named his coffee shop after Espresso. He called me <laughs> Bubble Baby, or but or Bubble or or Barrel Baby. <laughs> Shit, I'm not yeah. a Barrel Baby. I'm a Barrel <clears throat> Man. I can see it. I mean, like, what the hell? You know, like from a distance, you know, you were on the roof. They were looking up at you and you were carrying a barrel. So you probably looked like maybe two feet. Tall. And a baby at one point. You were carrying someone's baby that you gave away. That's true. You did have a baby as well. <laughs> That's true. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Remember the, the baby you jumped out the window with? I remember the baby. Yeah. Okay, what fine. What the baby got home? I'm the barrel baby. <laughs> <laughs> how can how can the barrel baby make a barrel of cash <laughs> I think we should do like a basketball with a barrel kind of deal but the basketball is too big <laughs> um, what if uh, what if we theme it around the statue that's exactly what I was thinking yeah. right is like so, have one for each thing so instead of a ball it's a baby and we dunk the baby that is... <laughs> but like a fake baby, fake baby, fake baby. Un unethical, and maybe it would concern some people. Put uh, the baby in the barrel. The barrel baby. Put the right? baby in the barrel. And you just shoot the baby. <laughs> shoot the baby <laughs> is the name of the game. That just says. <laughs> shoot the baby, yeah. Okay. I think that's yeah, a Yeah, sure, okay. man. Yeah. We've, got, we've got shoot the baby. You do notice people are setting up their own sort of like festival games and stuff. That. How do we rig this? Yeah, we'll just have saran wrap in there. Okay, sure. We'll <laughs> yeah, find works. saran wrap. In There's the gonna island. be saran wrap somewhere in the, so in the <laughs> saran island. district. Okay, what's the ultimate prize? Uh, a real baby. A dinner date. A dinner date with Gillian. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Right. Can I dress him up? <laughs> Oh, fuck. Yes. I'm like clearly <laughs> unconscious be, too. A dinner be, date like, with Gillian. I'm gonna be like sweating That's through awesome. it. I'm gonna be like having nightmares. <laughs> oh fuck off! That's so funny. <laughs> okay, are we just doing shoot the baby, or do we want another game? Um, we could have like one of those like water gun ones for the fish, where you have to like shoot it you... into a thing. Okay. Um, That's like a, just an idea. Guys, I, I wrote baby. fun activities for you, and you're like doing the same things that I have written. <laughs> oh <laughs> <my God. laughs> it's so funny. If we see other people setting these up, I totally want to like go up and steal their stuff and make it ours. <laughs> you check? saw you saw somebody setting up like a hoop. Steal. <laughs> they walk yeah, away to go grab. They come back with a ball, and you've stolen it all. Mm -hmm. You don't even have to roll for it, and they roll just bet. sort of like, okay. it's like the, it's the, you know the meme where he's like looking around the house, it's a very go, fucking, oh, fucking, where he's like, fiction, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's like doing that, that person comes back with a little, like, a little leather bouncy ball. <laughs> Wait, leather isn't bouncy, you know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's already like, their entire stand has been rebranded <laughs> to ours. That's awesome. <laughs> I, my stuff! That's about all you hear from that. Sorry, bro, I just went to go on the basketball. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Um, Everybody in this town wasn't going to be British. <laughs> they are now, I guess. We have one oh fucking bit. We should we should get raft back. This sucks. Fill the fish. <laughs> it's like a yeah. little blow up fish. You p put water into it, and then like, yeah, Fill not a real fish. fish. Not a real fish. <laughs> Just a real, like oh a fake God. fish, and you shoot the water gun into it, and then if you yeah. fill it all the way to the top, you win, and the balloon pops. 
Yeah, it when the balloon pops. Rigged. But the balloon? You put you fill a, it up with so much water a, so that the balloon a, pops. It's a condom, so it doesn't pop. Let's go. <laughs> it's one of those unpoppable balloons yes. that we definitely can find. Shoot the baby, fill the fish. Um, we rig it with an unpoppable balloon. <laughs> <laughs> What's a bird game? Um, um, duck grab, hunt, just duck hunt. Grab the bird. Yeah. Grab the bird? Grab the bird is actually awesome. We have a cage <laughs> with a bird in it. Oh my god, can we illusion a bird in some way that's not real? <laughs> god, can, Gillian's not. Can I? I don't have the, the spell prep. I can't. It's easy, though. We can get a real bird. <laughs> we like grease it up. We get we cover it in butter. So they can't if they go to grab it, it's gonna slip right out of their hands because it's all buttery. And I'm just imagining, you know, one of those like hurricane machines where you like had to grab the yes, fucking money in yes, it. Yes, you grab all the money. <laughs> it's like that. It's, it's that, but just a big but cage a and there's a bird. <laughs> and I also I also butter up the ground so they slip. Can't catch. There's a lot of butter involved in this plan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Think of, we also butter everything up the baby. We buttery. also butter up the baby. <laughs> Do not butter the shit out of that baby. In my brain, I'm like, how would fucking the most experienced dungeon masters handle what I'm being put through right now? Like, what would I'm they sorry, do? Dude. What would they say? How would they do this? To be honest, I can't figure it out yet. Is there an answer? <laughs> keep going. Would Matthew keep going. Mercer let you butter the baby? <laughs> I wonder what he would say. Truly. He might just say no. Um. Okay, so you've already acquired the things you need for shoot the baby. <laughs> That's what did I type that? <laughs> That's what it's called. That's what it's called. Is that That's what, what it's called? called? Yeah. Shoot the baby. Why is it called shoot yeah. the baby? Because it's you, like a, you, it's like when, when you to, have when you're playing to, basketball, to provide, you shoot it. To provide a moral challenge as well as a physical <laughs> one. <laughs> this is awful, dude. Okay, toss the baby. I've changed the title in my no, notes. No, no, no. You've lost sight of the game. So that one, you've already gotten most of the things that you need. Butter is pretty okay. easy. It's just going to cost a little bit of money, but you already stole like the Spend basketball. Spend money to make money. Basketball. It was going to be blind basketball. You saw on a sign. But um, they took it. You took all this stuff and they don't know what to do about it. So you got all that. Disguised it well enough. So you're checked there. However, for the other games, you will need to procure a water gun and invent a condom. Okay, 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 okay. Would you say and invent a condom? Sure did. <laughs> they don't what? got condoms? We don't have condoms in this world. Condoms? Oh, fuck. Not yet. <laughs> they would, they there's would have a, condoms? Because they like fucking birth control it, man. Oh my no. god, guys, we're going down this road. Are you sure hole. they wouldn't even have like lambskin condoms? It's what they used in the olden days. Unpoppable balloons, condom in parentheses, are not, they don't exist. Jay will have to invent them. You're just gonna have to find a balloon and then figure out how to enchant it to be unpoppable as an artificer. Uh, Chip, you're gonna have to find a water gun and a fish. So for you, investigation. Um, and then for Jay, arcane. 21! Condoms are real! <laughs> Fantastic, dude. You Natural 20. <laughs> Natural twin. Okay, easy enough. Jay, then. Jay just solved the population crisis. <laughs> so, okay, and you're 21, Jay, and you're natural 20. Not only can you find the water gun and a fish, but you procure and buy. You roll natural 20. You don't have to buy these things. You just procure them. You find some birds. You also find a tank. Yes. Jay, I need you to roll one more arcana to enchant the tank, I guess. Find some help. Find a way to get the, the tank to whenever someone steps in it, it gets uh, a bunch of wind happens. Oh, I was just gonna, uh, I can only do that once a day. Never mind. I was gonna say, I was just gonna flip the winds going. <laughs> I rolled a natural one. <laughs> Everything is solved with butter, dude. Okay, so it's there, there will be a, there will be like a little tank with a bunch of buttery birds, but there won't be any wind. Got it? Okay. I'm gonna, if it looks like they're about to catch it, I'm gonna use the winds going. <laughs> okay. Okay, good, good, good. Nobody mentioned that birds probably couldn't fly if covered in butter. <laughs> I end up experiencing an insane updraft into a ceiling. <laughs> you've got all the equipment. You've got to set up. This takes a, about two hours or yeah. so. So it's definitely sunset now. Still not quite festival time, although a lot of people have started to gather. You begin to smell like sweets, um, you know, different pastries coming from the, the bubble district. And uh, there's even people bringing like display uh sort of tents or on the awnings of like different uh wares you know like those like when you're walking through your new york and you see people who have like a bunch of like 
necklaces or like hats and stuff like that. Like this, mm-hmm. there's a very similar vibe here. People are gathering in this town square um, and up and down different streets and whatnot to create the sort of market festival, hanging lights. It's a very warm atmosphere, very sweet. How are we branding our, our stand today? Um, it needs to draw people in, you know? Uh, big sign, it says, meet the heroes of zero. And and in parentheses, and win a date with Gillian. <laughs> um, Am I just like collapsed on the floor in the yeah, middle of you're, like, you're on, like a really no. no, you're like you're in a suit and tie, um, and you're just like lean. One second, let me like give you a good example. Like, you're lean like this, like arms Jesus out Christ. on the fucking arms of the chair. Um, yeah, and he's absolutely sweating through all of it, and just like occasionally screams out in terror and like <laughs> grabs at the sky. We like smash cut over and we're just have all this stuff. Yeah, a few all hours right. fast. I was Can we be in carny attire as well? Carnival? I feel like we need to be in like, yeah. Oh my God. You definitely don't need to do that. Do they need to do any of this? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you're, if you're looking at what other people are wearing, it's definitely not that. <laughs> but you know what I bet would, would separate you from the, from the rabble, right? I guess you could. There is a particular set of tents that you notice. In the Umbrella District, that look carnivalesque. Just some tents, though, like one big three-tier okay. tent. If you're looking for outfits. Yeah, can we just like be wearing one second? Let me show you. There's <laughs> some bullshit like this. Oh, oh my, my god. god! Oh, like quartet <laughs> outfits? You don't have to go to yeah. the, you don't have to go to any carnival-style tents for that. I want to look like this. Yeah, whatever it takes, wherever I gotta go, whatever I gotta do, I want to look like a candy cane with a hat. Yeah, so it's basically just uh, uh, white and red uh, stripes going vertically down the shirt with a bow tie and a flat straw hat uh, with a red little ribbon around it. Uh, very, <laughs> I've very got a cane carnival. as well. Oh and a my cane, God. of course. You can't not have a cane. <laughs> and I'm standing out there. Step right up, one and all. Come along and play the game. Okay, okay, okay. So how does this sound? Um, Shoot the ball, baby. Is... Hmm. A DC 25 uh, dexterity check to yes. keep it in yeah. the barrel without bouncing out, or even shoot they it without throwing it hard this. enough. Because they'd that... have to throw it hard enough to rip or get the super lucky, right? Much. Or get yeah. like insanely lucky. Fill the fish is a DC 25, probably just maybe dex again. These can all just be dexterity, but it decreases with every participant um, by a that few makes sense. as that more makes water sense. gets mm-hmm. inside the bubble. Um, even the most magical condom that you have invented cannot hold. And oh, no. um, <laughs> and catch the bird is another DC twenty five dexterity check. Is that all good for you guys? That's perfect. yeah. I was gonna say slide a hand for the bird. Oh but... yeah, slide a hand makes a lot of sense for catch the. Yeah, oh, okay, good, good. I mean, it's still basically dex unless they have okay, proficiency. Basically just dex. These and are all dex games. Just before we get into that, you said there were people standing around with like necklaces and such, kind of like they do in in New York. Yeah, yeah, where they have like blankets set out or, or like market stalls or like you know like wagons and stuff that have different wares and stuff. Yeah. Are they not just like people standing around holding them? Like trying to put them on you? Yeah, because this is what I want to do. Um, <laughs> just before we get into that. All right, that's all set up. It doesn't look like they're doing so well. Just one second. Excuse me. Um, what is yeah. it you're, you're selling over here? I got some necklaces. Oh, if you nice. want them. Um, I, I mean, I don't want them and, and surely nobody's going to want them. I mean, <laughs> you're not you're not really selling yourself very well. How oh, dare sorry. You? I, I, sorry, I don't mean to be rude. I just, I'd like to help you if you wouldn't mind. You see now that you're talking to like a 14 year old boy who is, um. Oh, God, don't give him another one. <laughs> <laughs> trying to sell these necklaces. He's got like just the top part of his head has hair and it ties back into a very small ponytail. The, the sides are, are shaved. And uh, he goes, All right, chum, what do you want? Watch this. I'm going to teach you a little trick. Give me just one of those necklaces. I um roll persuasion. Okay. Do you even have to? No, no. <laughs> Thirty three. Never mind. <laughs> Jesse, he gives you one of the necklaces. <laughs> what are you doing? Watch, watch this. I I wait for somebody to walk by. Easy enough. Somebody walks by. What do you do? Do they? I, I'm waiting for a specific type of person. Someone who looks gullible. Probably the most gullible person I can find. He's currently in a, asleep in a chair, unfortunately. 
Okay, so... Most gullible aware person. <laughs> you see a very rotund human man with patchy, like, a patchy gray beard. Bald. And he passes by. He looks pretty gullible. I walk up to him, and I go... And I, I, the first thing I do is put the necklace around his neck. Oh, wow, wow, that necklace looks really good on you. Look at that there. Okay, that'll be, uh, that'll be two gold. I look him dead in the face, and I look angry. You know what sucks is, like, I can't even have you roll anything, because it'll just be a fucking 40. So... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, so, man. It's fine. It's fine. This I old man... skill. This old man looks at you, looks down at the necklace. I feel pretty. Thanks, you are pretty. And he gives you two gold. I flip one of the coins over to the kid. Whoa! Just like that. Don't ask him if they want to buy it. Here, here, here. Just put here, it around here, their here, neck. Here. He gives you another necklace. Again, again. No, 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 no. Listen, I'm a pro. I could do this all day. You do it. To that person, and that person, and that person, and spread this technique throughout the world. Do you understand <laughs> me? <laughs> His eyes light up. <laughs> they, <I> sparkle. <laughs> they sparkle. They like, sparkle. Like rub his head. Go forth. He salutes. Aye, aye. I salute. I step away and I start marching over to Jay. Okay. I just started something horrible. This is the most fucked what up thing you you've ever done, do? dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just marketing, Jay. Just marketing. Oh uh, speaking of marketing, how's our prize doing? And go out, walk over um, to Gilly, and I like look at him, make sure he's not... a little more than normal. <laughs> yeah, he's, been, he's actually been completely silent. <laughs> uh, I mean, I, I mean, I mean, yeah, no, he's screaming. <laughs> no, uh, no terrors or drowning or anything. Uh, nothing that I've seen. He twitches. Uh, um, I think he'll be fine for the day. That's what really matters. <laughs> There's right not now. gonna be a date, Jay. <laughs> we wouldn't put Gillian on a date with just some stranger. Okay, but like, there's a chance, right? Like, what if somebody with how? like, how? We've we've rigged every game. They're not gonna win. Okay, yeah, I mean, that's fair. That's true. I do have com. I have a lot of confidence in my own pop-up balloon in parentheses condom. Condom, strange. Yeah, I don't. I don't know where I got that word. It just kind of came to me. Well, all right. <laughs> Gross. Let's make some <laughs> I'm some smiles. Money. Money. Our smiles. Specifically. <laughs> I'll be smiling when we're rich. For you guys, a few hours passes until the sun completely sets and the festival becomes into full swing. Almost like a like a scent of cinnamon fills the air. As the amount of, you know, different pastries and and, and finger food that is come into the vicinity has just you know all mixed into the cinnamon like smell you both are sitting there you've got your sign up how much is each game again one gold per thing and to pop the or shoot the baby you get three balls for a gold you get one minute for fill the fish yeah and one minute for catch the bird 30 seconds that <laughs> But time doesn't stack, so they'd have to try again, pretty much. Okay. Yeah. So, like, you know, if they did fill the fish after their round, we'd empty the fish. Pretty much. Thank you for letting me do this. <laughs> <laughs> and also, I'm sorry. Gillian. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it takes, like, five minutes to fall asleep. Oh, you're having so much fun, man. Come on. I mean, you just <laughs> knock out because you're so exhausted. And for you guys, I mean, I'm sorry I broke your improv by saying he wasn't screaming or anything. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. But for the most because part, for dead. the most part, he has for the for the few hours. I mean, like he hasn't been super, you know, loud. Maybe that one moment he just screamed, <laughs> but um, oh nothing, nothing like alarming for a few hours. But for you, Gillian, you find yourself standing on. A slick, jagged rock surrounded by a black, horrible sea. An angry ocean. A burst of purple, purple purple-ish, purple-bluish lightning. 
crashes in the sky. And with one blink, more stepping stones appear in the ocean, leading to some sort of shack. What if I just don't? Do you say that or, th- or think that? <laughs> yeah, I say that, I say that. What if I just don't? Yeah, okay. Um, uh, Gillian is just gonna sit down on the, uh, it's <laughs> just gonna sit down on the rock he's at right now. All right. You sit down? Yep. You're staring out at that shack. Waves crash up on your left and right, unable to reach you on this, you know, a little bit, you know, this only wide enough to hold you, but a tall, the tall jagged rock. And then you feel someone place a hand on your shoulder. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, I, I run into the shack. <laughs> <laughs> really? Okay, really? You just, as soon yeah, as you yeah, feel yeah. it, you, you like, you, like burst up and right bolt. <laughs> and you take shelter into the shack. And it's dark. You no longer hear that harsh storm. Nor the ocean. I look around and see what is in the room. You have dark vision. I do. Take one step forward. I went within about 10 feet. You happen to step on a skull and crush it. And the rest of your vision reveals countless dead bodies and they all share faces of people you care about go ahead and roll that con check to see if you stay asleep is it a save or is it a check what is it oh sorry yeah it's a save that's what I mean okay 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 natural 20 (laughs) natural 20 oh fuck yeah natural 20 you blink you're sitting on that rock? Yeah, that's probably what it would be like if I went inside. So I'll <laughs> stay out. <laughs> so I'll stay out here. And we switch back over to the festival. You guys are sort of shouting out, trying to get people's attention. At first, it's not really clicking, but then you get uh, a person walking up that looks pretty um like very like kind of like scrawny and like bald headed it's just some some dude and he comes up and he goes uh one gold for the baby basketball yes that's right sir one gold for the baby basketball you shoot the baby and you can and you can get it in and you'll get the basketball and you'll shoot it up my my partner here will tell you more about it all, all right uh what do, what do i win a date with gillian tide strider the the man who saved zero you point over at Gillian, who's just like, just like, <laughs> I'm slowly sliding down in the chair, just perspirating. You guys are somewhat nearby the fountain. I, I bite at the air. So he looks at uh, Gillian, looks at uh, the fountain. Oh, I see. All He's right. the fish. All right. Can I do some kind of uh, charisma roll? Well, incapacitated. Go ahead, go ahead. With, with disadvantage, bro. Disadvantage. Yeah, no, I have disadvantage too because of uh, uh, fucking exhaustion. Okay, wait. What? What? What role? What role is this? Fucking performance. With disadvantage. Yeah, I seriously. I can see that. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. That's gonna be a ten. Mm-hmm. Um, a ten. I'm gonna. Yeah. Very um, neutral. For you're nightmares. gonna what? You're asleep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna uh, sweat more and. Uh, <laughs> this is your like fastest and, and performance. Scream. All right. The scream. So he goes. Oh, all right. Yeah. I'll give it a shot. So he hands you a gold. You can go ahead and add a <laughs> Dude gold. Dude is settling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He was a. All right. He was a fourteen. Gonna, I'll add it to mine for now. He grabs like the little baby doll. And then it's all buttered up. Why? It's so, uh, so, oh God, it's like, oh man. Um, Freshly then, born, you know how it is. Oh, I thought they were they were real. Wait, are they? No. He like, no, like tries to check. Look, hey, you don't need to inspect the balls. Just give them a shot. Just shoot them up into the hoop and there they go. Oh, okay, uh, yeah, whatever. Um, and then he, like, put it, he, like, <laughs> he like puts it over his head and then throws it as far as he can. It actually does land in the barrel, but then it bounces out. He goes, ah. Darn. Oh, close one. 
Ooh, so close. Just that close. Hey, go ahead and try again. You got three balls in total. Here's another baby. <laughs> <laughs> Give him one. <laughs> I throw it out of well, it's, it's, the It's face. one gold for three babies? Yeah, awesome. three babies. Oh, man, this is a better deal I thought. Okay. Shit. Well, hey, well, you know, we're, we're a lot of things, but you can't call us unfair. You know what I mean? Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I went on didn't get it. Go ahead and try uh, this one. Here you go. It keeps throw bouncing it out, out of the more barrel. Butter, I don't... More butter gets on him. All right. He's like covered in this sl like <laughs> sludge of butter now. Gonna have, go ahead and roll again. It's, it's a small barrel. It's hard to get in. You know, it's yeah, it... even worse. So this time he doesn't even land in the barrel. Oh, man. Uh, oh, all right. better luck next time. Hey, you're free to try one of our other games. Fill the fish or catch the bird. Uh, I mean, also uh, one gold. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Maybe later. Yeah. Uh, see ya. <laughs> okay. Or maybe Bye. now. Nah. All right. Hey Chip, I don't know if this is working. I, too stand, good. I stand in front of him. <laughs> or maybe now. <laughs> hey Chip, I don't think we need to like uh, co coerce people. Uh, I'm kind of hungry, so uh, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go get a some cinnamon rolls. I just look at him and I step aside, but I stare like directly. As uh, you're staring at him. Jay, you notice somebody else. It's a, it's a, a, it seems to be a little bit younger of a girl. She has uh, like brown hair that, um, or like dark brown hair that sort of almost like straightens out into these two straight braids at the back. Mm -hmm. uh, she's wearing this like, like accentuated sort of like festival sort of hat um, with a dress that has sort of like these, uh, like it kind of frills at the, at the bottom and then uh, is covered with like some sort of uh, like over the shoulder coat or cloak that it like stops just uh, around the mid back and um, she walks up and she goes hi can can I um <laughs> hi uh, I want to catch the bird please uh, gold get yeah. your gold oh okay yeah okay yeah I, I look I... at Jay <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do we like you, you, uh, you oh, would, she's not gonna catch you, the bird. Because you're observing, you do notice that uh, she has parents that are just sort of off the way, looking at like some of the wares, okay. like some of the necklaces uh, that that little boy is selling. The sort of machine, I guess, turns on a little bit, and all the birds <laughs> start flying. And she looks like she's having a great time. She's getting extremely messy with all the buttery birds. She <laughs> rolls. Why a, are they all butter? Like, <laughs> oh, no, no. She does not so roll really up at all. Instead, she gets a lot of bird shit on her. And they're like pecking at her, and then she uh, she walks out. She's like covered in feathers now and like all messy. And she goes, "Oh, that that was fun." And then you look at her parents who who see her walking out, and then they fucking scream, grab her, and then uh, start to start to rush off home. <laughs> I uh, come back soon. <laughs> with that though, with that you uh, start to get more attention, and people start to uh, notice your games, and more and more people come by and hand you gold. You guys are about to make nice 10 gold total. I'm going to roll. Oh boy. Uh, to see who, if anybody, passes one of these games. I kind of want somebody to pass a game so we have to fake a date with Gillian when he's asleep. Absolutely <laughs> insane <laughs> that these people are seeing a, a, like, foaming at the mouth, just like <laughs> decrepit fish man. A little ways into the night, Jay would probably pull a side chip and be like, hey, Chip, um, what do we do you know about <laughs> that what? maybe sounds like bat well at the butter i mean i I put all the butter on the birds and no no that's easily cleanable i don't have any more butter that's fine we're not worried about the butter i'm talking about gillian i mean he's he's got the well, same gillian doesn't need you. Any butter what does gillian need with butter i mean everybody needs butter okay but yes. that's not the point Chief, even that's like... not the point i'm talking about the what are you asking do, uh, do we have any plan, any idea of how to get it, get rid of it? We had to go all the way into the northern sea. How get do rid we of get yours. rid of my curse? Pretty sure, uh... That's, I'm pretty sure we got you, like, we exercised went, in, in it Liquidus. Like a, <laughs> we went, we yeah, went we into, went in and fought your demons. Felipe. We went to a... Church. Like a church. Yeah. Okay, so we just find a church. Maybe they Do have a church here. Church here? We can go into his dreams and fight his demons. 
With an anti-matter rifle? <laughs> okay, yeah. I guess let's try that. All right, just ask around. But first, I mean, he gotta... looks fine, though. I look over at him. <laughs> Sponge, SpongeBob, gross up. His skin is like <laughs> wrinkling and drying. <laughs> He's sleepwalking. It's so it's so gross. It's so genuinely foul. Half of him is half of him is dry. Half of him is wet. It's like he's soaked in sweat, but his lips are somehow really dry, oh. <laughs> like, like splitting. Oh. You you also notice Gillian every once in a while will just twitch, um, and in your mind, Gillian, over oh. and over again, every time that you try to stay on that rock, you feel someone try to touch your shoulder, and it's again you kind of run back in, yeah. and. You're able to sort of shake off the fact that every time you go into this hut, it's filled with people yeah. that you care about, but you know it's a nightmare deep down. So you're able to kind of I do. tough it out. Can I start? Can I start trying nightmare hacks? Like, <laughs> I don't know if you guys ever do this, where you like it's still a nightmare, but you try to vivid dream. So like, you know, maybe I maybe I try some other shit. Maybe I try and make an antimatter rifle and like no scope. <laughs> whoever like has this hand, maybe I try and like. Dive into the sea. For the most part, you can try wherever you wish, okay. but just like your first nightmare, the result is always the same. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. And the one thing that kind of sinks in is at least you have this many people to care about. Yeah, you know what? I feel better. <laughs> For you guys in the festival, um, you're talking about this, and all of a sudden you hear a loud ass pop, just psh, and the sound of oh shit, I burst. <laughs> the, the sound of, of of some sort of liquid uh, filling the area, and people like, kind of cheering Ooh. and stuff. And you look over and you see that a ton yeah. of people, um, probably you probably made about like at least twenty gold now. A ton of people have been working on both the. Uh, uh, balloons and trying to get the baby in the in the in the fucking no one catches the birds they just can't do it. Um, <laughs> trying to get trying to get the baby in the in the and uh, there's also butter on the triggers of the guns in the barrel. Yeah. Why? Oh my Why god. But anyway, I mean like it, it takes like at least 15 people just trying to trying to fill this balloon <laughs> you know up. What it is? And then the guns are the guns are jammed. <laughs> They're just smeared and jammed. Finally, after what feels like maybe an hour or 45 minutes at least, you hear it. And you look over after kind of having this discussion about what to do about Gillian. And you see holding the buttery water gun. Well, guess that makes me the winner. You look, you see Ollie, who just bursted your giant magical condom with <laughs> with being the one what person a, to fill it up. Just good enough. sentence. <laughs> what an awful sentence. And next to him, you have spoken. Next time you see um, sort of in a, a much cleaner gown now, you see his mother in a... In a and just like kind of like pushing a wheelchair, and he looks over. He goes, "Oh my God, it's just all." He goes, "What's your, what's my prize?" With this like very, <sighs> you know, <laughs> sly, oh, shit eating grin. Uh, read. Uh, uh, congratulations, <laughs> Ollie. You get, and I, I put your hand down. You get. <laughs> I look through my bag. <laughs> <laughs> you get. I look through Jay's bag. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say I your bag is full anything. of acid. Yeah, it's... I have a uh, King Edison's tome of thoughts. I take King Edison's tome of thoughts. Can I take <laughs> okay. that? That yeah, really has I... never come up, has it? Okay. It hasn't. I don't know how to use it. I pull it out and I go, "You win this book." I quit ruining the games. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Thanks. It's magical. You can like inscribe your thoughts in it or something. That's what that's every cool. journal is, Kandi. <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, <laughs> what are you guys doing? You know, celebrating with the people of this island that we saved and profiting. Is this a scheme? No. Yes. <laughs> I think the guy over there has you beat on schemes. What? You look to the guy over there. You look over it. You see a, look um, over. another bald man, kind of silky skin, wearing a full suit that has a bit of like, um, sort of like patterns on it, sitting on a cloth, like a, like a little pillow, like a cloth pillow. 
and in front of him, he's just sitting there, and there's a sign that says, Guess the hand. Guess and painted hand. on his forehead is an eyeball, a vertical eyeball. So people keep sitting down, handing him gold coin, and then he seems to shuffle it within his hands, and then they try to guess. They get it wrong. He keeps the gold, and they move on. And you see behind him is a sack filled with gold. I'll show him who the best schemer is. Wait, 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 wait. Comparatively, wait, 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 wait. you've made about 15, like I said, 15 gold. And he looks to have at least 40 in that bag. We will show him who's the best schemer by out-scheming him. I don't know. That yeah, guy just looks like he has like, talent. I was just going to go, like, beat him in his own game. By the way, why was well, you that? You can't beat him in its own game because it's not a game. It's a scam. Well, yeah, true. <laughs> but what if you scope out the game and then we... Like, figure out how he does it and, like, I could be, like... You could you could sit down and I could like signal to you which hand it's in once I figure out his strategy. But how are you gonna know what hand it's in? With my eyes. Also, what about your games? Oh, you can run the games. <gasps> yes, yes. Mom, we're gonna make money. She looks just be kind of like smiling and looking around <laughs> and nodding. It's been a while since she's been outside, just in, just soaking it in. It's good to see you out and about. I think kind of give her a soft smile. Are you guys going to go over to the man? Yes, absolutely. I'm going to go watch him for a bit. Just so I can assist with this bit, the truth coin falls out of Gillian's pocket. <laughs> as he slumps over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Yeah, I'll pick that up. Sure. Okay. How about you go and do it, and I will observe. So you want me to sit down and give him the gold coin? And go from there? Mm-hmm. Okay, Let's do you think you there. can observe... Well enough? Are you... I'll give it a shot. Okay. I uh, go and take a seat and I slam a gold coin in front of this man. I'd like to, in time with her slamming the gold coin, jump into it. I'm imagining he's got like a, like a boxed off little area that he's in. I'd like <laughs> to get in there sneakily in some way. Whether that's like jumping in when he doesn't see or like cutting some cloth and going in like I'm Splinter Cell. <laughs> this isn't a scam, it's just crime. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. What's the difference, really? You sit down, he slams his gold, he goes, Hello there, sweetheart. Care to fancy a bet? That. Yes. <laughs> well, one gold, you guess right, and you get it back, plus another. You guess wrong, I keep, and you can play again or move on. Sound good? Okay. Right then. You grab the coin. Eye contact with Chip if I can. Okay. So Chip, you're just gonna be watching from behind. I'm watching from behind, seeing if he like puts his hand under the table or does anything. He's what, sneaky. Go ahead. Okay. So here's what I'll say. Here's what I'll say. Chip, roll investigation, and then Jay, roll perception to watch mm. his hands. Ooh, twenty-two. Ooh. Ooh. Fourteen for me. With the 22, you notice under his suit, sort of the suit coat, um, it's, it kind of billows out in like almost like a tailcoat, but it's just sort of resting behind him like a piano sitting at a, you know, piano. Uh, but behind you, you do see sort of multiple, almost like lumps. And Jay, with a 14, pick a hand, left or right. He goes, he actually says that. Pick a hand, left or right. After he moves at this like... I think for a moment, does Chip signal me at all? Did I see with you with anything? that with that you notice that it looks like he has stuff under his coat, but you don't notice any like weird cheap sort of movement with his hands. I just kind of shrug. <laughs> and Jay, I'll just let you know that whatever you pick, I mean, you are pretty confident about this with your roll. Left. Opens it up. Shows there's a coin. Goes, well, excellent. I give you two coins back, and then he makes another coin appear, somewhat almost like magically. And he says, or we can double it. This is how they get you guys. This is how they get you. <laughs> she wipes the sweat from her Oh, brow. no. Oh, this no. <laughs> I'd like to assess the lumps. Wait on what Jay says. You're on. So, Chip, 
you watch from underneath the coat, the lumps, and Jay in front of you, you both kind of see another pair of arms sort of slide out from underneath. <laughs> he doubled it. Bro is a spider. Okay, so he's going to use one coin and put the other coin on the, on the side. And if you win, you get four coins back. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Yeah. So once uh, again... Do I roll perception again? Yeah, go ahead and roll perception. Chip, if you want to try and help, she can just roll with advantage. I will try and help, yes. I want to just keep an eye from behind. Yeah. So Jay, go ahead and roll uh, with advantage. Wow, it's the exact same roll. Uh, 14. Less confident this time, but he rapidly, with all four arms, moves this coin in between his hands. And then stops... And you can guess, uh, you can guess uh, like the left top, top left, um, top right, bottom left, bottom right. Uh, bottom left. Big bottom left. Yeah. He moves it forward, opens his hand, and there's nothing there. Damn. Ah. Uh, you cheated. You did that. You four hands. <laughs> <laughs> no cheating here. I swear. That wasn't part of the deal. Well, you're free up to for try a again. Fifty-fifty percent chance. This time we can quadruple it. Even though you lost, if you win this next one, <laughs> you'll get it all back and more. Wow, that's that's a really charitable deal. I'll take it. But if you lose this time, Wait. that's more gold for me that you must pay. Uh, Are we still in agreement? I just kind of mouth, this guy sucks. <laughs> and I point at the bag of gold and I go, like I have gesture, like I just take it. Um, I blink once for a yes. I uh, just go, is, is there something in your eye? <laughs> or are you saying yes? Yes. <laughs> and that's a response to Chip and the guy at the same time. <laughs> Completely <laughs> accidentally. Excellent. Oh. So, you watch... Another pair of arms slide underneath the coat. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude. So six arms in total. <laughs> Keep up and it'll run out of arms eventually. Chip, while he does this next part with Jay, this I'm not next gonna, I'm not gonna take it right away. Okay. I am going to inspect for any kind of booby traps. Okay, excellent. You can roll um for this, it's it's really either investigation or yeah, investigation's fine. Jay, roll another perception what? check, but since Chip is looking for something else, no advantage. This is a 16. Okay, so I don't need to uh, be attuned to the Ring of Certainty. Uh, and I've never used it before, so I'd like to use it now and okay. uh, figure out what the DC is for this check. You can tell it's with one coin, six arms. This is going to be a DC 25 perception check. <laughs> I had to get a natural 20. <laughs> oh my god, dude. And before it was not the time. What? Did you get it? <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> what is dude, wrong with you? Dude, what is you wrong with you? You just have, you just have you something. You make me sick. I'm We're not even off. playing the same fucking game. <laughs> oh, dude, it's, the same it's not even game. funny. It's not even what funny. Matters? I press the button. I you press the, the fucking scam, perception man. You're the fucking scam. <laughs> it's you. I press. I rolled the dice on D and D Beyond. And it hit the top of the screen and just landed on the twenty. It did not roll at all. <laughs> Like it just you make me <laughs> sick. Who were you in a past life to you, bring you this fucking This guy, he had luck. fucking six arms and he gambled and he gambled with travelers. There's a there's a there's a glean in Jesus Jay's eye. Christ. And she watches the coin exchange hands. So I think that means he even get, says anything. Like I'm not even I'm not even really good at math. So I'm just yeah. gonna say, um this is what happened. Okay. First of all, Chip, you notice that on that bag, you just barely get a glimpse. It's being held by another hand. <laughs> uh, God <laughs> damn it, man. He's got it on lock. For Jay, all six arms move at a rapid pace. <laughs> and then he stops. You pick your desired hand. It opens up. And there it is. The gold coin. And he says, Well, well, well. Lucky. Or a fantastic eye. I was just tricking you with my last failure. 
<laughs> it seems I have been outplayed. Well, that's 12 coins. Or we can play again. <laughs> no, honestly, no. <laughs> Fuck this. I go yes, I go yes, I go yes, I go yes. If you play uh, yes. again and win, that'll be almost all the gold that I have. I just... I, I, <laughs> In natural 20 I can't do that again and at this point he actually <laughs> moves the bag to his side and in front of Jay what do you say can I can I use the ring of certainty one more time I don't think you can use it multiple times let me read it what does it say it says two charges oh then yes <laughs> what would the DC be with an extra pair of arms I'm guessing it would have to be a natural 20 no matter what <laughs> Dude, the die would grow a new sign for you. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm not even worried. Uh, I have the DC written down here, but I'm trying to think of a more interesting way to do it so that it's passable. <laughs> so what if with you the ring of certainty D8 and I have to guess the number? I love that. A D8? Yeah, let's fucking yeah, do it, dude. Because it would be eight. It would be eight arms, right? Yeah, that's. I'm good. trying to that's like really give good. Chip the chance to fucking steal this. Okay, shit. hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. What if you rolled a D8 and then, based on his perception check, it uh, like eliminated some possibilities? Like a natural twenty, I know. I'll, I know the answer. Yeah, you probably. Uh, yeah, no don't even worry about it. You probably will. <laughs> There's no point. Shut the fuck up. There's no way. So he did move the bag, so it will be harder to steal if you're gonna try and do it. But you would notice that he does pull out an extra set of arms. His last oh, pair. Christ, Christ. So course. he's got a total. Is there anything around me, just quickly, of equal weight? Maybe there's like a sandbag that's weighing the <laughs> you tent could, down. You could fill it. You could fill a sack with babies. Maybe I could <laughs> fill it. Oh my god! <laughs> Shit! Can I get over to the butter baby? <laughs> I want to go. I want to gesture to Ollie if I can, and just say, "Throw the butter baby." Just like roll it over to me. Okay. Um, he's gonna try and toss it to you. Oh God, no! That's his first no. mistake. <laughs> like quiet, like slowly, slowly. Roll, oh, no. roll okay. it. Just roll it near me. Baby, don't roll. Shit. He's gonna overhand it like an arc and try and just get it like oh, really God. high. You're just oh, gonna have to God. try and catch it. Okay. Just roll flat dexterity. Okay. It's a seven. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> you try to catch it. Um, and it like slips down your hands, down your whole entire body. You get all buttered <laughs> out, and you just hear <laughs> like just slop hit the ground uh, behind this man. But at that point, because he rolled so low, he actually starts moving his hands very rapidly, and the game between him and Jay starts. So he doesn't notice, but you freeze for a second and and realize how bad that could have gone. <laughs> but anyways, you have the baby. He just rolled really low to receive. I will roll very high now. Okay, I rolled. I have the D8 number. Just roll your perception. 13. Okay. You know, it's not going to be the eighth hand. It won't be the fourth hand. It won't be the second hand. And it won't be the sixth. Got it? Okay. I'm going to guess three. The hands move at an insane speed. All of them. With the one coin. sweating. (laughs) And... You go for the third hand after he stops. Gives you this very cunning smirk. And when he opens it, there's no coin. Damn. He opens the first hand. And there's the coin. I rolled a one. Yeah. So he looks at you. I suppose that's the game then. Unless. Can I, <laughs> no, <I'm kidding>. ask, <laughs> can I ask Jay? Just like gesture to put your hand on him. In some way, I just like, like side put your hands, shit, but I, I get put it. Put your I'm hands like, on his hands. Listen, your hand on that his was that hand. was really well fought, though. You know, I I didn't think I'd be beaten in a game of reception. Can I shake your hands? <laughs> no, just just. <laughs> <laughs> you are you are the first two have made it this far, and I am. <laughs> I got to say, I'm quite impressed. It's gonna be like a handshake, and then like the second hand on top, like really just. <laughs> Like the really grateful handshake, trying to keep him distracted. <laughs> okay, as, you're going for the shake. Check what you doing. Yeah. As Jay touches her hand onto him, I'd like to mimic that same kind of pattern of touch while pulling this bag out of his hand and slipping the butter baby <laughs> onto it. And I'll just kind of hold my finger on top to make sure it doesn't slip out. There's no more because okay, there's no there's there's no more hand on the bag. Oh my fuck! I just take the bag. I just take the bag. I just take the bag. I missed that gotta, part. You gotta leave the calling card, bro. You gotta, 
I do leave the calling card. I do leave the butter baby. Yeah. <laughs> like, the idea is like when you pickpocket somebody, you touch them in some other place. No, and no, take I the thought thing. that was, that was su super no, smart too. That's smart, you know what yeah. it made me think of the videos where they put the fake hand and the real hand between a, a barrier and uh -huh. they stab the fake hand and the guy's like, oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. That's super smart, man. Just go ahead and roll slide it down. That's a twenty-one. Okay. With the 21, you open the bag and you're just trying, or no, you're not trying to take anything. You're just taking the bag itself. Grab the bag and I put the butter, b the buttered up baby, <laughs> baby. I put the ball where it was as a calling card and I slip away and I show Jay and I walk away like a cartoonish villain, like the guy from <laughs> Meet the Robinsons. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay, okay. I take a bowler hat off of some guy's thing and I get a little piece of seaweed and I twist it and I slink away. Hey, but you know, maybe I could do like one more round. Chip, you grab the bag, you start seeing your way. When you take the bag from its spot, you notice just under where the bag was placed, there seems to be in the in, in like in like the tapestry that he's sitting on that covers the pillow. There seems to be like some sort of um, a symbol, uh, like a like a diamond with a circle in the middle, kind of resembles the vertical eye that you saw on his forehead. And Jay, you go to play another game, and he says. I apologize. Uh, we we should we should really give more people a chance to play. But I do appreciate I do appreciate your enthusiasm. Have a fair night here at the festival. Enjoy your stay. Absolutely. Thank you so much. It was a lot of fun. Much gold, my dad, by the way. That that I think that was twenty four gold or something like that. We'll just say yeah, twenty four gold. Twelve or twenty four. I doubled twelve, but I was like, no. By this time, you would have like quintupled. Hey, what's the one after quintuple, Candy? <laughs> yeah, sex double. Sex yeah! double. <laughs> so, uh, both of you walk away from this game, and you notice that um, Ali is still running the games uh, with his mother, but also they're sort of in conversation with Mr. Rico uh, by your games. And by this time, a lot of people oh. have, um, we'll say, a few hours have passed, and a lot of people, or a few hours passed, and a lot of people have. Enjoyed your game, but not to the fullest because they can never win. And none of them ever win, except for Ollie. And uh, no one gets the baby in the butter, and I mean, in the fucking barrel, and nobody catches the birds. So eventually, people stop coming to play your game. You lost 24 gold. You made probably 24 gold. You basically broke even. Like, this is this is how the night went. Well, we also stole the, the, stole the bag, so... Right, right. You have that 40 gold in there. Um, so we broke a little more than even, I'd say. Excellent, excellent job, excellent job. All you have to do is line steal. By this point, just for easy, I'd say that Gillian, you're able to wake up with long rest. What? Oh, no, you don't have to. Groggily, your eyes sort of like slowly open. They almost stick together with how sleepy you are. Oh, but Jesus. you get enough rest to get the long rest, the benefits, and the nightmares were horrendous, but you made it through. Yeah. And... There's this kind of like gut feeling yeah. that tells you they're just going to get worse over time. And yeah. being able to sleep through them is going to get harder. Well, uh, being a hero waits for no one. Wh whose son is this? And I and I pick up a <laughs> greased up baby uh, that's lying next to me. Uh, <laughs> slips out of my hands, falls. Oh, no. Oh, hey, Gillian. You guys rejoin. Everybody, everybody's in this group now. Mr. Rico, mm. Ollie's mother. Ollie, you're so small and smooth. That's the. That's I'm a over butter. here. That's a butter oh. baby. Hey, Ollie. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I tuck the the baby in my uh, uh, in my shirt and uh, <laughs> walk, walk over. You to notice? Him. You notice how like well you're dressed? <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. You're in like suit tie. Uh, whoa. Uh. uh Gam Gillian, what what happened? What happened here? Yeah. Um, <laughs> we we just wanted to make sure Gillian you looked good while we were crazy. at the festival. <laughs> oh hey I, hey I, Jay I, hey Chip. Um hey. hey did I did I I feel like I missed a lot. Oh no you didn't you didn't miss so much we're just uh 
making a little money, and I start shaking around the bag, but then oh. I hide it from the guy. Hey, well, I mean, by this point, you look over, the guy's gone. So we've made an enemy who has now left. Yeah, you you just <laughs> wronged an eldritch creature, dude. Like, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, that kind of like, <laughs> like yeah. you the definitely with like did. A, and with a circle in it, eye thing, that's totally had, like gonna come back dude, to haunt us. He had his own symbol. He had eight arms. He's probably called like the fucking collector or some shit. Like, <laughs> dude, dude, there's, I mean, there's there's no way he's not. <laughs> he's bald too. From I mean, another yeah, guy. How yeah, much? How much it. money problems will we have in this campaign? Is the real question. <laughs> um, not many after I win this and I go in and try and catch the birds. Um, <laughs> uh, what's what's going on? Where am I? You guys are live. Check. Sweet, Ollie, you're good too. Awesome, not skeleton. That's good. Good stuff, everyone. Yeah, it's great. Everybody's alive. Okay. Well, how can <laughs> I? How can I help? Well, we are waiting for you to wake up. And then we we're gonna go kill the bad guy. Oh, you know I love killing the bad guy. I think we're almost done here. Would you say the festival is coming to a close, it's, or is it going? Um, it's still going strong. I mean, there's still lots of people. It's uh definitely late at night. People are like, you know, drinking, having more fun. A lot of the gaming, or not the gaming. A lot of the, a lot of the activities have been. Uh, you know, sort of uh, uh, worn out. Like they've 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 uh, done their studies, but now it's more like social. Um, still, that Ugh. sweet smell of cinnamon in the air, and 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 great food and drinks, and it, it reminds you of, you know, back in Laughing Lot when you guys partook yeah, in I that, that festival oh. and the uh, you know just socialization you guys had with the Prince of Edison Kingdom <laughs> on your ship, and then now you guys just sort of you see Ollie <laughs> and. Mr. Rico, the, the the man that he first met or talked to whenever you guys arrived here, that pointed him toward his mom, and his mom is there as well. They're all just sort of conversating when you guys step away to greet Gillian. We want to maybe look around at the festivities before we go, though? Oh, uh, sure. I'm going to do, can I do a quick little sweep to see what, what we're working with? What kind of festivities there are that maybe we'd be interested in? Yeah. I mean, there was, there was definitely going to be more of them. What do my fish eyes see? But, um, th th they were stolen. So any, any <laughs> really good ones that perhaps someone was excited to run that are just now packing yeah. up and have time for one more game. Yes, actually <laughs> there is, there is one that stands out to you, Gillian, <gasps> and it sort of looks like ye old punching bag arcade game game um where oh. <laughs> where it's a bag tied by a rope that seems to be in some weird pulley system that is connected to a weight and if you punch the bag hard enough it'll hit a target the weight will move and it will uh it will give you a score on, 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 on like a pinwheel number system uh, whatever that means and so it's basically you, you know that you know the games in the arcade where you walk up you punch the bag and it gives you a score right yeah yeah I know it's exactly basically like that about. but ye old version so that's what you're looking oh, at. Oh, guys, can we try? Uh, it's not a. It's not gonna be called the punching bag because it's <laughs> sack, sack, blow, <laughs> deliver a blow. Swing a sack. This is swing a sack. Sa Come on, swing guys. your sack. Come on, guys, let's swing our sacks. Oh, I'll swing a sack. Yeah, let's swing our sacks together. I don't know if I can. The strongest swack sack swing gets a singing swack sack of swack and swing and swack of scold. Silver. Silver. Come on, Jay. I believe in you. I actually think we should call the an ambulance. I think he's having a stroke. Swing um, on. Now swing and swack. Stroke. Stroke a swing what? and swack. Step All right. on up. Uh, he's getting. What okay. Is he, what uh, is he saying? He's becoming more incomprehensible. He's talking about stroking his sack. <laughs> uh, I, 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 I walk over there. Uh, uh, yeah, yes, yes, kind sir. We'd like a, we'd like a, uh, try at the sack. This is a hearty, like, blushy-cheeked, um, uncle of a, of a human being who has a very, very exaggerated mustache. And, um, so you guys want to try the, the swing a sack. So go ahead, <laughs> go ahead and just make a strength check. Who's ever up first? Nice sack. Can, do we, do we take turns or do we all go at once? So how does this work? Uh, we team it? Uh, we team, uh, can we one at a time. One, one at a time. Okay. Um, one at a time. I, uh, I sort of, I sort of instinctively reach for my <laughs> sword. Uh, see that it's not there. Oh, shoot, Jay Chip. I need, I, I need some kind of, some kind of weapon to, to, to draw out my full power I'll on give, the sack. I'll give him my crazy sword. I What's give a him, crazy I know, sword? I give him another boater, baby. 
Only blunt, <laughs> only blunt objects or your fish. Please, no cutting the sack. Okay. No cutting the sack. Oh, all right. I'd love to do a blunt, but I roll them horribly. This baby will have to work. And I grab, <laughs> uh, I grab the child from Jay by the ankle uh, and charge it with divine power and sway it like a baseball bat <laughs> at, this, at the sack. Like I said, it's still a strength check. <laughs> okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, Christ. I got a four. Um, <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> hang on, no, 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 no. I, won't awesome. let, I won't let this baby go quietly into the night. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to use... Uh, I'm scared of this episode, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna use magical. I'm gonna use magical guidance. I'm gonna spend a single sorcery point, and I'm going to re-roll that strength check. And it's a natural one. <laughs> the, the baby is so buttery still. It slips out of I your know. hands, and you just hear a crash as it lands into someone's window. <laughs> and then, <laughs> and you you just whiff the bag like you don't even hit it. You just fucking whiff and fall, dude. And like I the baby's whiff gone. The bag, dude. Fuck. Well, at least that child will have a beautiful life. Feel free to try again for another uh, gold hey, piece. I want to run up and kick it. I want to run up and like like Dragon Liu Kang kick that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah. All right, strength check. And land on Gillian. God, okay, I hope I we just not. keep missing it. Natural 20! Oh, oh my god! god. What is going <laughs> on? <laughs> no, let me have this. I never get those. So, no, good for you. Hey, man, I'm, I'm happy for you, dude. So a 22? Take this with me. Take this with will, me. Can I, will, I include I Gillian okay, in this okay, somehow? Bet. Can All me right. and Gillian do this together and be powerful? No, no, no it's, one, no, it's one at a time. I'm on the ground and I drop my baby and I'm throwing up and I just had a terrible nightmare <laughs> throwing just, up. Can you just look at me and tell, you, tell me you believe in me? <laughs> Dude. Okay. Unrelated? Unrelated to the, the thing okay. we're doing here? I just really need that right now? Uh, short, short ship, um, I think that whatever you put your mind and heart into, you can do. Uh, like, like the elders always told me, uh, words to keep in my heart always, Dragon Pow. <laughs> I do it, I do it, I Dragon and he Pow. does a Dragon Pow. I actually, you know what I do? <laughs> it's just flavor, but I'd like to cast some kind of fire just to like make my leg look fiery as I do it. It doesn't have any added damage. Doesn't even matter, dude. Jay, I hope you didn't want to play this game because Chip runs up and drop kicks it. <laughs> Um, and it explodes, and <laughs> <laughs> we're we're terrorists. <laughs> we're full on terrorists. Oh and best, just horrible, horrible people. <laughs> oh my god! Fuck, dude. Does the guy die in the blast or what? <laughs> <laughs> so it explodes. His mouth goes agape, and then he just sort of like. Puts his hand on his, he just hand, slides his hand down his face, and his expression changes as he slides it down. And he says, "I need a drink." <laughs> Here you go, you one, woohoo! And then he hands you a walnut <laughs> and walks away. I thought he said Vegas silver coins, not a walnut. <laughs> oh, nice! I eat it. He hands you a walnut. <laughs> you eat the walnut, but he hands it a chip. He hands it a chip. Oh, oh! I hold it. Well, he, wow. He lied, Jay. No <laughs> silver coins. <laughs> Are you hungry? You wow. can eat that? A walnut. You can a eat walnut. that. Thanks, Thanks like, mister. Maybe it's like magical. He's gone, dude. Hey, He's going to get you hey, and you're fucking drunk. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. <laughs> hey, dude. Are you going to eat that? <laughs> Gillian, you're being really weird about the walnut. <laughs> I'm just wondering, man, if you're going to finish that off or if you need any help. Are you still laying on the ground? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I take it and I look down at you. I, I, I like my oh my god! <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help I'll it. I put it in. Okay. okay, you crunch on the walnut. I swallow. Roll. <laughs> Wait, you just swallowed whole, no biting? <laughs> yeah, like a oh. snake. <laughs> um, there's just like a little <laughs> lump in his throat. Gets <laughs> stuck. Okay, roll a roll a strength check. This curse means nothing to me. My life is a nightmare. Uh, Fifteen. <laughs> You swallow the walnut. It's okay. very difficult. And you didn't expect it to be so because it's so small. And it feels like a hunk of metal drops into your stomach. It's heavy. That hit the spot. Well, I could go for something a little lighter. So it clearly wasn't a walnut, right? Like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know. Yeah, it looked like a walnut. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, we'll find out in 24 hours, I guess. <laughs> yeah, you have two curses. I don't know what to tell you. Um, <laughs> wow, that's weird. I'm allergic to walnuts and nothing happened. Do you guys have any games you really want to play? It looks like actually everybody, after they saw what just happened, they're taking down their tents. You guys begin to sort of exit the town, but you hear all the, hey, hey, where are you guys going? Oh, um, oh, just, just, you know, around. I act real casual. My, my, mo- so my casual mom's right feeling now. better and you never really got Mr. Come meet Mr. Rico and, and my mom. Oh, um, <laughs> um, I don't know. There's some real bad boys out there we need to I, punish. And- I look at Ollie. Does he have that like cartoonish childlike yes. like yes. <laughs> longing? Yes, of course. Oh. <laughs> No, no, okay. no doubt, no right. doubt, no doubt. Come on, guys, we got it. We got to do it. We got to do it. We can't say no to that face, and that's what caused all of these problems. <laughs> all right, let's go see Mr. Rico. They're, they're all in the group already. They're all just kind of looking at you. I uh, don't be shy. Come here. I walk over. <laughs> I shake his hand. He shakes yours, but he his he has basically have like button, mittens for hands. He's so 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 burly. He looks at you and he says, "So you uh kept little Oliver alive, huh?" When hearing some stories. Oh, yeah, you know, we just did a little bit of this, a little bit of that, and then boom, bam, bop, he's here. And then nothing dangerous happened. He's looking at you like a, like at a, like a judgmental uncle. <laughs> mm-hmm. At all. And that's nothing. The scoop we kept him so that. safe. The you besides, take that to the bank. Besides and the beasts. Deposit it. <laughs> the beasts, uh, the the beasts, beasts. That, that we dressed up <laughs> as when we went to. Like parties and stuff, because we had a lot of fun. It was just fun. You know, it was just fun. Like, he's on the open kid. sea. Tons Never seen any horrors oh, beyond your imagination. Oh, I remember the party. Was that the one with the Dark Lord? <laughs> I just Tell me about this Dark Lord. Mm-hmm. How much danger do you get into out there? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was the one with the Dark Lord. No, Dark Lord was <laughs> oh, super, super cool. It was like a. Murder mystery and everything was fine at the end. No one really died at all. Besides him. Yeah. He died. Yeah. Cause I cut his, cause like I, in a yeah. peaceful way, you know, like he screamed quite a bit. <laughs> and then he sort of like is he withered up and turned into right. shadow. Mm, but Ollie wasn't there for that. No, oh, yeah, Ollie wasn't Ollie wasn't there. He was no, on the ship, we left so. him on the boat. With our right? with our robot. And our... So what are you going <laughs> to here? <laughs> Anything interesting? I'll be asking on? the questions, <laughs> okay, Mr. Byron. He's still holding right. your arm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is he getting tighter? Ripping yeah. real tight. Yeah. <laughs> There's tension. Yeah, I don't have very good circulation. This is. This could be dangerous for me. Quietly, you hear. Thank you. You see, uh, Ollie's mom. Ollie's a good kid. Couldn't just let him drift off with Marshall John. Who? <laughs> she says. Who? And then uh, as, uh, as as she says that, uh-huh. all of you hear from what seems like high up in the town towards the, the big raft ter- tower, you hear. Ah! What the f- what? It's this Someone's... blood-curling scream that just echoes throughout the town, far, far away up above, into the highest points of the, the island. It's silent for like two seconds. Okay, someone just died or powered up. We gotta go. <laughs> uh, and I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start uh, 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 running that way. All right, so you start, you start running. Uh, and then Very st- nice to talk to you. Glad, glad we could, we could do this. And I'm just walking away. Uh, definitely didn't introduce your child to a uh, magical book that made him grow like really tall. It's nothing, nothing bad. I'll see you later. <laughs> you both run off. Jay, do you go with him? He's like, where, where, where are you going? Where are um, you going? What's, what's the matter? Did you not just hear like blood curdling s- scream? Yeah, we hear that often. Weekly. What? <laughs> what? Yeah, it's some crazy person living up there. Every once in a while, they come down. You know, beaten out of their mind, looking for food, shelter, I mean, food, water, medical attention, and then they go back up and, eh. It's probably not a big deal. You don't have to worry about it. And then you guys already, like, ran off, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't hear anything. Yeah, I, I'd be gone. <laughs> All right, so you kind of rush off. Ollie's like, wait, wait, wait. 
where you, so you guys head up to back to the the tower and yeah wherever that screams from there you don't see anything at first so jay go ahead and roll a perception okay i say you just because you're observant but anyone else who wants to try it oh my god i'm like besides that 120 i'm rolling in the lower tens lately if anybody wants to help jay or, or roll yourself go ahead can I put my hands over her eyes and make little binoculars to give her the help action? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. Yay! <laughs> Need you to zoom in a little bit, Gil. Okay, I rotate them slightly <laughs> inwards. Oh, sorry, wrong way. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, wrong way. Ten. <laughs> Ten. <laughs> so you're like looking around and then and then Gillian's trying to help you, but it really just like puts two circles in front of your eyes. Um, you're not seeing anything, you don't hear anything, but then you guys here panting from behind you and then you see our chip you'd see ollie who ran up the steps after you and he goes hey hey ollie, what are you doing here yeah it's fine my mom going is to- gonna hang out with we're- mr rico what you're going after that scream yeah but you, you're supposed to stay back there Look, with your mom yeah i know but you're not gonna get around this island without me i lived here okay look i have an idea um and then he uh, walks over to sort of like the right side of this top part and then moves rubble aside and reveals this sort of hidden path that exit the town and into the forested mountains of the of Canela. Look, don't tell oh, anybody about this. Detention. What? Whoa. Yeah. How did you... How did, holy shit, okay. Well, yeah. whenever cool. I got bullied, this is where I ran to hide away. Who bullied you? We can kill them too. Yeah, where are they? They might have died in the war. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. <laughs> that's <laughs> yeah. That's really dark. Yeah. I haven't seen them yet. Maybe. Good for them. <laughs> <laughs> Valhalla. No, that doesn't exist. No, oh, that's so sad. You guys um, only pop off, dab them up. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> he doesn't understand the gravity. Anyways, so. Yeah. All right, come on. You guys lead the way, but it's probably this way. You can come this time. Just don't. Jump into like danger, okay? No danger. I just want to help you. Say it with me, no danger. I'm a part of the, the crew. I've been in danger. But I'm born for this. I was. No, but he's right. No, but he's right. He's right, Holly. Don't jump into danger. Leaves your legs exposed. Run into danger very fast before it can react. Let's go. Oh I, my I start, god! I start crawling <laughs> through. Okay. Um, okay. If it's tight, if it's tight, we can use the butter. No, it's, it just—it's um, just sort of like a. Um, we do have a little bit of butter. We do <laughs> yeah, have butter. Of butter. It's not necessarily a. You gonna eat that? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait! Where did but- butter came up in the one shot for the Black Rose Pirates? Where you guys covered? Yes, your- because when they were taken, like, and canonically, when all of the dark shit happened, they were all covered in butter. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my that's god. So butter funny. is a sign of the end times in Riptide. Yeah, uh, we're getting close. So you guys. Yep head down. It's not like a man-made path or anything. It's just sort of a, a, a makeshift clearing where trees aren't growing in this forest. And, and you're walking up the incline of the mountain, sometimes having to climb over like steep cliffs. Eventually, you hear <laughs> and then <laughs> just someone struggling uh, up, up, up the way a little bit distant. But it gets louder and louder the more you get closer. Do you, like, sneak up on them? What do you want me to say? You don't have armor on. You can sneak a lot easier. <laughs> oh, you're, wait, you're, you're, you're right. I mean, what if they're in danger now? Um, does it sound like they're, like, actively, like, getting hurt? Or, like, what does it sound like? Yeah, you, it was a really good guess. Yeah. It sounds like they're actively getting hurt. Um, there's pauses okay. in between, like, breaks. So it's not like they're, you know, it just sounds like a single person struggling. It doesn't sound like multiple, okay. just single. Jay, Jay, you're big smart, and I ate a walnut, so I'll follow your lead. Yeah, I'll follow oh. your lead, too. Whatever you think. Okay, well, we've never snuck before, and we're not going to start now. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Balls deep. I'm with that, it. That's what I like to hear. Um... <laughs> Okay, cool. And I uh, pull out another baby, and uh, and uh, yeah, let's just fu- let's let's fucking go for it. Okay, Riptide Pirates on three. One, two, two, two three. three. Riptide, Riptide Pirates. Pirates. I, I scream and running towards the sound. <laughs> I'm running towards it. Uh, I, I I like light something on fire. Uh, <laughs> you, so all of you rush up. You go even faster. You pick up the pace, and you find yourselves. 
uh, stopped by a singular person crouched down, clutching their stomach, and in front of them is just a two-story house. Are you okay? What did that house do to you? No, stay back! I'll take care of this myself! And they rush up. What? They, they rush up to the house. They they run into like the entryway, and then you're and then get thrown right back out in front of you. Damn. Whoa. That's gonna Damn. that's gonna be that's gonna be three four bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> and that is where we're gonna end this session. This is like twenty eight hundred square feet. No. I was ready to fight Monster House. <laughs> Fuck. Monster House. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh, oh my shit. God. Oh, that's that's actually how bizarre. That's awesome. Thank you so much for listening to that episode of Just Roll With It, courtesy of Grizzly, Bisley, Condi, and Charlie Slime Skull. Hope you enjoyed that one. I know it was quite a wild ride, but here is the fun part. And we're actually all in person for this one here at the Slom Pound, recording the Suckening. It'll be over on Patreon, so make sure to subscribe to that. And here are the shoutouts to the high rollers. We're going to go in a circle, and no one can use the same voice twice. Starting off, Emperor Pengu69. Erica Moon. The Drift King. Kojo Wo. It's even the Mr. Double. A pirate with gout. Mr. C. And the skeleton aficionado. A depression made me buy this. The Game Hunter. I love you guys so much. Bumpo Skiing! Teeny Ghosts. Jim is rad. Willustrator. It's Sea Fresh. Me forever, mate. Skelta Boo. Stoost, dude. <laughs> Zerzaku. Charlie Darling Songbird. Firefox. 12092. <laughs> Firefox. <laughs> Eclipse 1680 Gaming. Mrs. Quinn Clipson. Look. Theory. Gatus Betus. Epicrest. Oh, shout out to you, Kaylin. Oh. Leftover Rass. Uh, third plague. <laughs> like a couple of. That's my next one, you fucking Sorry, bitch. Dude. You will rue the day! I'm back. It's just making noises. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, it's just burgers. Lucas! Jonathan Bleak. Luke Grombie. Thomas Pierce. Lemon Leviathan. Bebeness. Dappers. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. A Moon Beast fan. Bree Lee. Daxi Boy. Flavor! <laughs> oh, Kerbos. Did somebody say Colin? Flublibo! And butt flushing. You're what, dude? <laughs> <laughs> dude, what? Hagar Steeljaw! Beans! Crap whip! Wolfie! Jades! 2604! Lol! J8! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Joey Madness. Oh, name's Pippin! <laughs> Pippin the Alchemist! Mega Psionix. Uh, William. Tain Lambert, the snazziest. The gag day. Uh, Baka 7. Cal's the folded pizza zone. But right. awesome man, I guess. <laughs> fast, 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 fast. F bomb 02. Fly, fly guy. Hey, yeah, I'm Barcade. Robert Gangwir. Chin on vibes. I see shark. Bird Bird F. Jordan Dolan. Oh, I am in Abby, Katie, and Elliot. Red. Sus. Over paradise. Salmon Ducky! They're a lister. Mr. Nacho. Uh, Wild uh, James. <laughs> Sammy, bow the second. <laughs> Give Senpai. I have Jedi. No. Now I am Jed Ed. <coughs> Mitchell Iverson, your shit fuck. Mitchell! Mitchell, shut out, Mitchell! Don't even think about it. Let it out. Made the wrong ear. Boss go to. God the fuck. You still have to read the name. 
I did. He did. You I said Captain Lafayette. He did. Oh, he did. um, yeah. Grand Archer. Now I'll sell his. Geekly. <laughs> Legend. <laughs> Kyle Bins. Zero Codex. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're running out. We're running out. Deathclaw. Sandy uh, 007. <laughs> Winter's Mist. William Smith. <laughs> Apple. What? Soul of a pep. Cheshire. Oh, big man Christian. <laughs> I can hurt Rick and Morty now. Blue. Blend. Whoop. A big bear blow boy, big bear blow boy. <laughs> At least they're washed up bard. Oh, at Zerberus. Nice. Very nice. Cyborg. Alyssa. Obligatory references. <laughs> now exiting ranges. Cryos on this sin. <laughs> or ticklefish. Oi, that's fucking Spinyax, bruv. Oh, it's fucking brother, it's horse, bruv. You got brother down with that right there, man. Oi. He's Jacob Martinez, bro. Oh, Jacob Martinez, lad. He's doing some fucking coming with throw right down my fucking screen, bro. Like, is that Bionicle DNT, dude? Tanny loves bites. You know he's a loony. Ah, Gillian's biggest fan. Oh, the godly king. Oh, torn your comments. Sorcerer. Puck. Charm of the bard. Riker Kurotu. That's my favorite one. I did yeah. the same voice twice, but I like saying it like that. Kitsune. I'm not sorry. Asteria Nix, John. <coughs> George Benji. <laughs> <laughs> Come on down to Funny Hats Incorporated. We got all the funny hats. <laughs> <laughs> JRWI Enjoyer. Devenator. J. Noble. <laughs> Thank you all for uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's everybody. For yeah. That's, 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 all all that's, ev that's our entire vocal range. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for pledging to our Patreon. Hope you all and, enjoyed. Um, you stopped it? No. Oh. Look, look forward to the suckening coming soon. <laughs> look forward soon. to the suckening. Slurping soon near you. All right, everyone. Three, can't get off the slump two, pound. Can't get off the slump one. Patreon.com. <laughs> I, just, I just wanted to tell them that they could find it. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Patreon.com. So let's just roll with it. Please let us off the slump pound. Um, XOXO. One more. Just roll with it. All right. Here okay. comes the goo.